What's up, everybody? My name is Johnny Gamer today, guys. We're going to be doing a gameplay and commentary for the Goalie Studios Multiverse Royale game that I did. Because Goalie Studios was nice enough to let me join in for this one. Because I had the Harley Quinn skin, the Rebirth one. So I was allowed to join. And, um... You know, I'm a fellow content creator. I mean, he's a lot... He's got more subscribers and whatnot. He's bigger, way bigger than me uh, when it comes to channels, but you know, I'm still good when it comes to content and quality, so I matched the qualifications to join in. So here it is. Starting off, I go to Grimgate because I'm just like, alright, I'm going big or I'm going home because I wanted Cerberus' shotgun because this was last season. Chapter 5, Season 2, Miss and Mortals. So we start off, we get that chest, and I'm like, darn it, man, I got a stupid purple DMR. Because the DMR sucked that season. Literal dog water. Hated it. It's alright this season, but that last season, it just sucked. I don't know what about it. And this, I almost died here. <laughs> if I had stood on that and broke it, I would have fell to my death, and you guys wouldn't be seeing this video. <laughs> so then I'm trying, I'm trying to be cautious because of that. That's got me being cautious. I'm like, I'll break the floor. Oops, wrong floor. So I'll just break them one by one. So then I break all the slurp barrels. Grab the shockwaves. And, um... I think I drop my crown. That way my crown doesn't give me away. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what my plan was. And I wasn't going to lose my crown anyways. If you go into custom and you lose your crown, you don't lose it in the regular games, I believe. Don't quote me on that, but I'm pretty sure that's how it works. That's how the system works. So I'm popping Flowberries. R.I.P. Flowberries, by the way. They're no longer in the current meta. Or season. I don't know why I said meta. That's not the right word I was going for. But it works. And then I'm just looting around. I'm trying to keep, keep my distance from everybody. Trying to be safe. And I think this is where I challenge Cerberus. Yes, here we go. Challenging Cerberus. Breaking the statue. I was afraid I was going to get sniped there, honestly. Like, my heart was pounding. I remember that. Uh, this happened like a few months ago. This, I believe, was during uh, May. I think it was. I could be wrong. It was. It was right before chapter the the season had ended, like a few weeks, I think. Although I'm not exactly sure when. So then, I'm trying to loot up, I'm trying to fight all the wolves. Oh yeah, look, there's a E11 blaster there, that means this was during the last few weeks of the season. And then this guy tries to attack me, Mr. Tom Holland Spider-Man, Spider-Man No Way Home. I'm collecting more bananas, I'm trying to be careful. While fighting Cerberus, remember that, I've challenged Cerberus, so he's after me. And I'm also using the wings to try to keep my distance from everybody and try to play safe. And I believe right here is when I go in for the kill. Or no, I think I... Yes, I, I third party, that's right. They're fighting, and I third party up there. I get him low, I crack his shields, and I'm like, alright, I gotta push that. So I start pushing, and eventually I get him. Don't I? Yes, yes I do. Sorry to um, whoever was playing as No Way Home Spider-Man. Although I'm sure that everyone's forgiven each other at this rate. I mean, this was literally a few months ago. So then I'm camping on the roof, because the roof was like my safe spot. I'm, I'm shaking my head no here. I'm like, no, don't fight. Try to wait for your overshield to come back. Don't be a dummy. And then I see Shredder. And I'm like, how funny would it be if Harley Quinn killed Shredder? Because they're like, they're both, I don't want to say psychopaths. I don't know if that's the right word. I don't know, I forget their lore, honestly. There's so many franchises at this rate. And I'm a mastermind when it comes to Finds of Freddy's mainly, so that's taken up all my brain space for every other franchise. So anyways, I'm pretty sure I push him right here. I beam him with the pistol. 
and something funny that I remember is, uh, I'm pretty sure after this match, I checked Discord and that guy who played as Shredder actually like, I think he sweared at me in the Discord. I don't know. I can't remember. It may have been he may have been saying that to someone else. Although I'm pretty sure they said it to me. They just said like "f you" or something like that. So then I beam him, and he's low. So I'm like, all right, I gotta push that. Reload my gun. He's trying his best to get out of there. He luckily mantled. I don't know why I didn't shoot my gun, but luckily I get him anyways. And he tried to drop the medallion as a peace offering, uh, but he also had water bending, which is another reason why I wanted to get him. And I'm like, yes, I got water bending, I got the medallion. I just need to speed Cerberus, and I'll be fine. So like, I'm starting to panic here, getting a little excited. Pretty sure I was shaking. I'm shaking right now, surprisingly. I don't know why I'm shaking. Just like, I guess my brain is recalling the moment. <laughs> So I'm flying back to Grim Gate, and luckily right there I don't die because the wings prevent fall damage, thank god. And um, I'm just trying to just chill on the roof, and I believe my plan was to just defeat Cerberus with the waterbending from the roof. So yeah, that's exactly what I do. But while being careful and being cautious of players around me, because... I think my biggest fear was getting sniped. I almost died there again, fall damage again. That's like the third time I've, I could have died to fall damage. Jeez. I literally saved myself last second. That's crazy. I don't remember that one. Like, I remember the first one, I don't remember that one. And I'm like, okay, I just gotta go one on one Cerberus. Let's do this. But then I think I get scared here because I think I hear someone on my visuals. No, wait, no. No, I, I was wrong. Alright, I defeat Cerberus, I get his shotgun, get his medallion, and I'm like, okay, I've got water bending, I've got Cerberus' shotgun, I've got two medallions. I'm probably one of the most overpowered players right now. And I just use all that Flowberry Fizz, that way no one else can get it. You know, be a little strategic. And look at me, I'm shaking my head yes, I'm like, yes, yes, this is all going according to my plan. Because I planned this out, like, I was making a plan, I'm pretty sure I even, like, practiced, I, like, warmed up before this, I don't remember exactly if I did. Uh, I know I streamed before this, so I probably played a few games, and I was warmed up pretty well. And... I'm just trying to loot up, I think right here I'm looking for... What, what am I looking for? Am I just searching things just to see if I can find anything? I don't know what I was looking for, honestly. I have everything I need. I got the server shotgun, I got waterbending, I got wings for mobility, I got flowberry fizz, I got two bananas. I think the only thing I could have been looking for there is possibly more bananas to just stack up in my inventory. Or or a fresh pair of wings, that's a possibility. I, I don't remember what's it, what it was going through my brain at this time. Anyways, I'm just... Swimming around Grimgate, just chilling out. And I think I pushed someone here in a moment. Because I see someone swimming. Am I correct? Oh yes, uh, that's I think that's Padme. Is it not? I, I don't remember. I'd have to watch the video. It's been forever. Which, might I say, Goalie Studios, you did an amazing job editing that video if you're watching this. Like, Props to you, man. That was crazy. I, I could not imagine taking all those clips and turning it all into one video. That is just insane editing skills, which would probably overwhelm me incredibly. So now I'm just pushing Padme. I'm chasing her. I, I think it's Padme. I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure it is Padme. I remember, I remember something. I'm pretty sure it, it's... I'm like 90% sure it's Padme. Yeah, it's Padme. Uh, I can tell now, that's Padme. I, that's, that's Padme. And she surprisingly didn't do any damage to me. I mean, she cracked my overshields, but it, that doesn't matter. Overshields come back automatically. So, defeated Padme, and I'm swimming to zone, just, or teleporting, I guess. Is, does that count as swimming if you're just... I mean, I am swimming. I'm dolphin diving. In a way, I'm flying. 
because I'm using the skulls every time, but at the same time I am going in the water, so... What would you call that? Swimming? Flying? Both? I don't know. <laughs> so anyways, I'm just... I'm gonna swim to zone, and... Uh, oh, Pandora's box is still there, so this was before all the Pandora live events started happening. Or mini live events, whatever they are. Did that count as a mini live event, or did it count as a live event? I don't remember. I think people did count it as a live event, but I'm not sure. Anyways, I blow up that car, and I believe I start chasing... I think it's... My brain's telling me Hawkeye, but I'm not 100% sure. Oh yeah, that's Hawkeye, right? Yeah, that's Hawkeye. Yeah, that's Hawkeye. And I believe, yeah, I start to panic. You can tell my control, my uh, aim wasn't doing well there, because I'm starting to panic, I'm starting to get nervous. I'm trying to use the lock-on from waterbending, because waterbending was literally aimbot back then. Like, waterbending, seriously. Please, if you bring it back, Fortnite, nerf it. It was so ridiculous how it locks on and how much damage it does. Like, seriously. And what happened there? He used the launch pad, but it, like, didn't work properly. That was weird. And I'm trying my best to get him, but he just keeps on getting away. I believe I was trying to attack everyone because that's how I felt Harley Quinn would play. Because she's, like... She's that kind of person. She's, I wouldn't say a killer, but she's the type of person to play aggressive. I would say that's the type of person she is. Although I can't really speak for myself because I'll admit I have not seen any of the movies or read any of the comics. Um, unless if you count the Batman Fortnite comics. <laughs> Those I all read plenty of times. I mean, you can probably guess how I got the skin. Which, by the way, I did get this skin from the comic. Yes, I did. I didn't get it from the item shop. I got it early. If you don't believe me, you can check out my past videos where i pretty sure I showed it. Uh, it was either a video or a live stream, I forget. You'd have to dig deep in my channel for that one. It was during Chapter 2, Season 6. Anyways, back to the gameplay. Enough talking about the comics. Um, I'm trying to heal up because I got beamed. And I'm going back to Grimgate to try to find any healing. And I see Miguel O'Hara over there, and I'm trying to beam him. Spider-Man 2099. And I get beamed myself with water bending, so I'm like, okay, time to get the heck out of here. Because I don't want to die this early. My goal was to at least make it to top 10. That was my goal. Or top 20, one of the two. I think my first goal is top 20, and my second goal is top 10. Um... Which, if you've seen the video, you you know what placement I got, but... Uh, you'll, you'll know what placement I got if you forgot by the end of this video, obviously. I'll say right now, I did not win. I did not win. Spoiler alert, I did not win this. I mean, if I won this, I'd probably title this, I won Goalie Studios Multiverse Royale, if anything. Because, you know, that's something worth making content about. <laughs> So I'm looking for healing. I'm trying to find shields here, I'm pretty sure, is what I'm looking for. Just any shields. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to do. Because they cracked me all my shields with water bending and whatever else. Um, sometimes I get so focused on my train of thought I forget what I'm doing in the game. Like, I'm watching it, but I'm like, as I'm thinking, I just, I forget what happened. And the water bending again, it gets me. And I'm like, okay. And they also got an NPC, so I'm trying to just... I'm I'm trying to leave that player alone. But obviously, they're going to push me. Because that's what you do in this scenario. So I push back at them to get them low, so that way they don't push me, because I'm low. That way, I have a higher chance of eliminating them. And I'm just trying to keep my distance, trying to play a little safe. And I believe I rotate into restored reels in a second here. 
Or maybe not. No, actually, I think I go... I don't remember exactly. I'm looking at Storm right now. I'm trying to figure out where the zone is. And I see a player, and I'm obviously like, alright, let's just go get them and see if they have heal healing. And I think that might be the same Hawkeye I was chasing, although I'm not sure. Is it him? Uh, I think it is. I didn't get a good look at him. <laughs> he's, he's so quick. Yeah, I think that is him. Oh wait, no, that's Groot. Is that Groot? I, I don't know, I can't tell. When, whenever I do these, the screen is like... It's not as big as it usually is in editing. Because I edit all my videos with Share Factory. Oh yeah, that's Groot. That's 100% Groot. And my water bedding just wouldn't lock on as well as it usually does. I don't know if they... Maybe... They probably nerfed it by then. Because the Avatar event had ended. Uh... I'm not sure exactly. I don't remember exactly how water bending works. Because currently it's week... 4 of chapter 5 season 3 wrecked so I'm kind of out of the whole water bending chapter 2 season 3 chapter 2 season chapter 5 season 2 mindset jeez can't speak <laughs> and that guy gets eliminated by someone else and oh I know what I was I was doing I was trying to eliminate them I was trying to eliminate players to get my health back because I have the siphon medallion which I think is something I forgot about, is players can track me because I have two medallions. I don't think I remembered that. And for some odd reason here, I crashed into a tree. I don't know why I did that. At all. And I'm just like, okay, I am in a very bad situation. I need to get going. And I believe I even get to the point where I freak out so much, I eat my banana, but I'm not sure. Banana of the gods pretty sure here I'm just looking for anything that will help benefit me and heal me. I pick up an extra water bending because that was a strategy that holding on to multiple water bendings that way you don't have to reload it. You can just switch to the next one. But I don't think that actually benefit me that much as I hoped. And here's when I run into my first problem. I'm just hip popping around, and I believe there's a guy in there. I heard him. I think he's in there. I'm not sure. And then I'm trying to dip, and unfortunately, unlike this season, cars back then actually took fuel if you used the boost. If it was like this season, I probably would have boosted out of there. I think I'm just camping here because I'm trying to wait for someone because I knew there was someone there. And I'm like, okay, well, time to third party. Because I was trying to be a third party person. But there was also someone else trying to third party. I'm like, oh, that's Michael Myers. I don't care if I die at this rate. I want to kill Michael Myers for the bit. So I do that, and dead. Killed by Toph. Game over. Bye, all my fellow gamers. Hey, what are you still doing here? Go watch one of the videos, come on. Look at that one on the left, that one looks really interesting. Oh, I don't know about that one on the right, that one also looks interesting. Eh, you decide.